step session with 12 times world record holder Carlos Costa. Hey guys, welcome to the blue classroom. It's it not is. a competition. <laughs> you keep dreaming and dark scheming. Yeah, you're doomed. You're a poison, and I know that it's some tune. My ears are like falling out my over my mouth. And like, uh, uh. You want to find out how Dubai went? Stay tuned. I'm here with the one and only Carlos Costa. Super cool that he wants to bring us into a training routine of a freediver. The plan is first we are going to the pool area to do some yoga, breathing exercises, pranayama, and then we jump to the boat to drive to the blue classroom, trying some depth dives. I'm super excited to go there. Let's start. I'm Carlos Costa, I'm Venezuelan, 45 years old. I started freediving in the year 97. In the last six years, I've been living in Bonaire practicing every day with my students, and developing my school and my training center. Uh, normally I start with waking up, do a yoga routine. I create a kind of plan, detailed plan about my dive. And I visualize all of these days and hours before. And it helped me a lot. For me, it's powerful to make my dive successfully. The fear is always around when you are pushing in extreme sport. Fear is part of the experience. You need to learn how to enjoy and to control the fear. It helps you to protect yourself, but as well it can help you to push the limits. When it makes possible and you make a world record, it makes you stronger, it makes you believe in yourself. This is what I felt in this first world record in the year 2002. I'm fully relaxed from the yoga. Are we guys ready? Yeah, total sense. Yes. yes. Buzz is sleeping. Relaxation is key. Relaxation. So we're on the boat now on our way to the platform. It's sunny, it's now windy, so it's perfect weather for a free dive session. Okay guys, welcome to the blue classroom. How do you feel? I feel very uh, chilled, namaste. A little bit excited. It's it not a competition. <laughs> Ready to go, having the wetsuit on. Pretty exciting to uh, go in the water. With your mask, fins, let's jump to the water, okay? We're ready. Super excited to go in the water, so let's go. Oh, it's my snorkel. Now we're ready. Keep dreaming and dark scheming, yeah you're doomed You're a poison and I know that I it's so true And we'll pull the line down and okay. we'll come back to friends, yeah. we'll do very slowly I'm focusing on your qualification you're suspicious You keep dreaming and dark scheming, yeah you're doomed all my friends think Great. you're vicious in the city. Yeah. This is it, yeah. It's time to practice dog dive. This is the way to start your dive. And let me show you. Yeah, you do. Breathe the cover the breath always after your dive. Okay, now I'm clear. Start to dive a little bit deeper, step by step. We're going to pull the line, going down, and we're going to come back using our legs and things. It means constant weight coming back. Let's do it. Let's do it. When your looks start depleting and your friends all start leaving, you're so plastic and it's tragic just for you. 
When you are coming back here, you feel comfortable? Yeah. Thank you that you can go deeper. Going great. Going perfect. Except for the equalization. Hey, that's so sexy. I'm always. There's a tennis ball on the bottom of the line, unless you're gonna try to reach it. Which is on 30 meters deep. Right now he's trying to focus on his breathing to your left and then he can go deep. What's really funny about this is that if Lasse managed to reach the depth, he will be going way deeper than Bach. Also than me, he has more training than us. He's going deeper than everyone here, except mine. Except mine. calm you down yeah. but you were like a drowning puppy almost. <laughs> <laughs> cut that out. Yeah. Record breakers here. Beep, beep. Beep, beep. Well Lars, congrats. Beep, beep. Yeah. Winner of today. Prettiest guy of the group. Uh, <laughs> and how did you guys find the going? Honest? honest. Should we be honest? Yeah. yeah. You did great. But <laughs> the relaxation was almost there. We were a little cold, depending on the tropics. Yeah. It's crazy. So if you come to Bonaire, bring a wetsuit. Like this. <laughs> no, but it was really fun. These guys are uh, awesome. And thanks everyone for helping out. And we definitely come back with a wetsuit and more relaxation. <laughs> nice. <laughs> What's up guys? It is three days later. And as you can see, I'm back on the platform because Lasse had the 31 and a half and I want to break it. Okay, Carlos, honest question. Do you think I will go deeper than Lasse or not? <laughs> 